And one of the hardest hit areas, Shenango County, remains in a state of emergency this evening with all non-essential travel banned. That's after some parts of the county, as you heard Jim talking about, saw nearly three feet of so snow. News Channel Lines, Josh Martin in Norwich for us tonight. Josh, been there. <laughs> I know it's not easy. Thanks for doing it. What's it like there? Shenango County still in a state of emergency tonight. A travel ban is still in effect until 6 o'clock this evening. As, as you can tell by my orange snow pants here, I'm standing in about two feet of snow. That's how much was coming down here in Norwich. I want to show you behind me. We're looking at North Broad Street. That's the busy street here in Norwich. Well, the snow has taken over the center lane. It's, you see those cars going by. Normally, you'd be able to see right across those lanes there, but there is a huge pile of snow that goes all down Broad Street. There is snow piling up in the center of the road. Let's take a look at some snow totals. These are from this morning. This is what people woke up to today. Bainbridge, just south of here, 28 inches. Green, south of here, a little less, 34 inches. Uh, Oxford, just a little ways back from here, 33 inches. And those totals have only grown. Our viewers have been sharing their photos and their videos to show you how much the snow has built up. And, you know, people have been spending the day digging out, trying to move some of that snow. Overnight, it was coming down at such a rate. The emergency management yeah, office here happen. tells me <laughs> that the plow drivers actually got snowed in. Some had trouble getting to work. Some had trouble getting out. They wanted to get out around 2 o'clock this morning, but the snow was too strong. It really pushed things back, and that had an impact throughout the day. Starting at 6 o'clock tonight, Shenango is moving from a travel ban to a travel advisory. People are being asked to stay home unless it's absolutely necessary to travel. We issued the travel advisory was nothing more to advise the, the motorists that the roads are open, but keep in mind, you know, we're not talking about optimal conditions. They're open, but we just want everybody to use caution as they travel because they're going to come across some of these areas and we just want them to be notified ahead of time. Matt Beckwith sharing with us some unfortunate news today. A neighbor here in Shenango County died this morning. They were attempting to shovel a lot of this snow, and they appeared to have some sort of cardiac episode. It is a reminder to people, don't try to take all this snow by yourself. Take your time with it. Know your limits. If you're going to shovel, do it in shifts. Do not try to do it all by yourself. As you can see, there is just way too much snow for one person to handle. Live in Norwich, Josh Martin, News Channel 9.